Hello, I'm William Brandon, filling in for the one and only Kim Rooster Rosteter. <laughs> Hello, I am William Brandon, coming to you live. <laughs> Hello, I am William Brandon, filling in for the one and only Kim Rooster Rosteter, coming to you live from the Rockville Beach Marathon in Wilmington, North Carolina. This is Spotlight Saturday, episode 162. I really don't know how to put it into any other word other than what you're watching right now. The joy, the smiles, it tells the story for itself. Hello everybody, absolutely love that intro. Well done. Uh, the challenge is there. Who's going to do better than that one? Maybe we have a new thing. Whoa, what's up, Kendall? <laughs> Made it all the way up here to Chicago. Came for a uh, speaking event at the Chicago Rotary Club. Super excited about that. And got to catch up with Kendall Jade. Isn't that awesome? Super excited about it. We're going to, uh, <laughs> well, yeah, yes, we did. Kendall, tell him. Tell him. If you look over there, that's the Willis Tower, formerly known as the Sears Tower. Yeah, we were up there earlier. Woo! I think there's a picture we can throw in. Maybe even some video. I don't know. But anyway, we found the Lakeshore Drive or the Lakeshore Front uh, Path. Super cool, Lake Michigan here. It's frozen, kind of neat. And uh, we're just gonna keep rolling, get our run streak in together. Got a nice path to run on, love it. Beautiful, beautiful day in Chicago. So, without further ado, uh, let's kick off this episode. I think the first thing we're gonna do maybe is get some footage uh, from tomorrow, <laughs> which is Wednesday. Joe and I headed up to the Marine Corps Marathon Charity Summit. But anyway, for now, uh, here on Tuesday, we're, uh, we're kicking it to Wednesday. <laughs> Tell them later. Say later, Gator! But, yeah, like, I, I don't know, like, everyone else, what I just saw there, but, yeah, the, the Willis Tower, thousands of feet. No, no, no. We're in a tunnel right now. It's, like, I don't know, a, a, a hundred feet. I don't know how many feet under the Chesapeake Bay. I would much rather be under the water than up there, uh, the 100th floor of the Willis Tower. Not not for me. Kendall Jade, I'm, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Um it was not not for me, as we all know from uh, previous Spotlight um, episodes. But yeah, we, we just finished the Marine Corps Marathon Charity Summit meeting for 2019. Great time as usual. Uh, and now we're we're home. You know, I know we're home because we're on the outside of the tunnel and the Chesapeake Bay is not frozen because it's 60 degrees. Warm here. Warmer here than it is in Chicago. But good news is we still have a few runner bibs available for the Marine Corps Marathon in our nation's capital, October 27, 2019. So if you are interested in running with the Marines, please contact me, operations at ainsleysangels.org. Maybe Bradley will do one of those cool things where it like pops up right here, or it'll be in the description. But yeah, a good, uh, don't look at the camera because you're driving, but it was a good, it was a good summit. Uh, and we're excited to be a charity partner for the sixth, fifth year. Yeah, yeah, five. Yeah, it's five. Five years, it's yeah, five. exciting stuff. So. Uh, Cheers, everyone. Uh, good times in Chicago, good times in Quantico, uh, good times all the way around. Now we're back in Virginia Beach, right, Rob? Yeah. And now I'm at FedEx. We've got three freedoms to ship out. Um, one of them is pretty exciting. This one right here is going to Northwest Arkansas. Why? Well, because one of our Marine Corps Marathon charity runners already hit their goal, and we're shipping this to the rider of the Angel team. So that's exciting. The other two, we got one going to West Virginia, our very first chair to put West Virginia on the map. Ainsley's Angels in West Virginia is happening. Uh, she's in the ambassador training program. Sarah's crushing it. She's doing really good stuff. Great, great uh, prospects for 2019. And the third one down there, well, always love to give chairs away so got one granted gonna uh, ship that one out today um what else we got today you know what let's go and uh, catch back up in north carolina and see what they were doing at the wrightsville half with kelly and the team oh we're getting ready to go to the start of the wrightsville beach marathon miss caroline are you running a marathon today yeah oh, are you excited about that yeah oh we can't wait and let's see we got diego Let's see who we got over here. We've got our guests from Virginia. Stacia, what are you doing here this morning? Doing the marathon. Oh, marathon in the books. Oh, and we got Woody. Woody, you doing a half marathon today? Yes. Oh, that's a yes. Oh, let's see who else we have over here. Oh, we got Eli. Eli, you doing a half marathon? Are you going to race today? Yes, he's going to race. Love that. Wrightsville Beach half. 
year after year, having good times, increasing the rider count, everybody having a blast. Uh, goodness, full marathon events. What a great time down there. I tell you, um, looking forward to, to coming down to Wilmington uh, for the Frosty 5K. As we've just added that race, it's going to be in December down in that area. We just added it. It's going to wrap up our Angels Angels race series. So uh, maybe some of you all can join us at the end of December too. Hey, we're going to wrap up this episode, make a, a quick trip back up north. As you might remember from episode 160, we pulled the name out of the hat. 161, we shipped the chair. And now Ambassador PJ's got the chair for the presentation. So check this out. We're going to uh, roll to the credits after that. There might be a blooper at the end, so stay tuned for the end. And of course, don't forget, you can nominate somebody in the uh, comments below to get a freedom in episode 170 we still got a couple spots for runners at the marine corps marathon and as always oh hey ask your ambassador the louisiana marathon codes are out for january 2020 so don't hesitate love to have y'all come roll with us down there in baton rouge for the 5k 10k or at least they call it the quarter and the, the 5k and they got a half and a full on sunday it's just a great time martin luther king weekend down in baton rouge in the shadow of the capital so for now, let's kick it up to PJ, wrap up this episode. You have a wonderful week. Hey, this is PJ from Ainsley's, Michigan. We got some excitement today. If you were watching Spotlight Saturday a couple weeks ago, one of our riders, Alyssa, got her name drawn. She's getting her chair today. She doesn't know it yet. So she's going to be here in a few minutes. We're going to surprise her with it. So shh, don't tell her. I have a magic trick I want to show you. Can I show you a magic trick? Do you like magic tricks? All right. I'm not a very good magician, but we'll see. I saw this on Facebook. All right. You ready? We'll see if I can do this, all right? Do we have something magical, like abracadabra or something? Or all peanut butter and jelly sandwich? No? Can we count to three? One, two, three! What's behind here? Oh, she doesn't see it. Oh, is that your new chair? <gasps> what is it? Yes. Yay! Do you want to take a ride in it? You yeah? You guys clap for it. Yeah, you Look think so? Oh, that wasn't surprise. a big enough yes. That's I don't know. Oh, there we go. Should we say thank you to Mr. Joe for pulling your name out? Tell us, can you sign thank you? No, You'll be all you shy now because the camera's I'm on, aren't you? You do it. You do it. Tell him thank you. All no, right. You do it. Are you just going <laughs> <Just gonna wait. laughs> Hey, when you watch ride? those Spotlight Saturdays, make sure to comment and nominate someone. You might win a chair also. We're going to go take a spin now and try it out. Giggle butt. You're a little excited there. We're a little please. excited here. <laughs> I am worried because she likes to bling and sparkle everything out. She might decorate this thing with like 200 pounds for me to push from now on, but. <laughs> we'll see. You ready to run? Here we go. Whoa. A young angel born with wings. She stays strong. Yeah, like all of you, I don't know what I just watched, but uh, you know, you're going over. The, man, my fingers are.